video is uh, talking about where Clipper stores its data and how we can find it and delete it if we have to. First off I should point out that the um, folder options should be uh, set to show hidden folders so that the app data can be seen. Application data which should be by default in this location. Uh, if you look at that address bar there, computer, you see drive users owner. If I click on that, uh, roaming, clipper, local store, database. So what I do is I make a shortcut of that to send it to the uh, desktop and there if I that's the database records of Clipper if I take that to the uh, bin it would uh, wipe everything from the application so that's where the database is Clipper automatically creates this folder, the Clipper Downloads folder on the desktop and here's the file that we downloaded earlier. Similarly if you want to get rid of these files you can. Clipper also creates the Clipper Playlist automatically a Clipper Playlist folder here. If you get rid of this it will wipe the memory of the Clipper player also when Clipper installs it automatically creates a shortcut for the uh, editor to the desktop and a shortcut for the player as well.